The increased use and complexity of underground spaces, especially in the context of tunneling, necessitates an improved ability to predict and understand the geologic structures to be encountered in the subsurface. Tunneling projects differ from typical construction projects in that their extreme depth and lateral extent mean that there will be a high degree of uncertainty associated with any predictions of geologic structures made from sparse initial investigations. This uncertainty leads to a common problem causing cost and schedule overruns in tunneling projects, which is encountering unexpected ground conditions. A unique aspect of tunneling is the availability of new information describing the subsurface geologic structures that can be collected along the excavated portion of the tunnel alignment. The goal here is to integrate all available information to both better predict geologic structures prior to excavation and to update these expectations in real time in the face of new information gathered uh, during excavation. Additionally, we will be utilizing 3D modeling to improve our ability to interpret and communicate complex real-world geologic settings. To provide a better understanding of the potential impacts of this work on mitigating unexpected ground conditions and tunneling projects, we will look at the Kargi Kizilirmak hydroelectric project, which is a recent tunneling project through hard rock in Turkey. Note that the disparity between the pre and post excavation cross sections shown here is not due to an insufficient or inaccurate pre characterization of the site geology. Instead, this is a testament to the inherent uncertainty associated with making predictions of geologic structures from sparse initial observations. During the first two kilometers of boring, unexpected ground conditions were encountered, leading to seven distinct stoppages of the tunnel boring machine, totaling over three months of project delays. Upon encountering the first set of unexpected ground conditions, the site engineers made the assumption that the problematic ground was isolated and that tunneling could continue as planned. Had the additional information from encountering the first occurrence of unexpected ground conditions been utilized to update our geologic understanding for the rest of the tunnel alignment, it is possible that the subsequent occurrences could have been predicted and their effects mitigated. In addition to being able to adapt our geologic understanding in real time to the unfolding conditions encountered while excavating, the end result of this work will be a fully characterized 3D model of the rock structure along the entire tunnel alignment. This model will be fundamental for improving the maintainability and longevity of any tunneling infrastructure. Thank you.